night. I was just driving to the shop. I needed some celery to go in some soup. I saw something in the grass on the side of the road. So I like put on the brakes, swerve over. I think I knew something wasn't right as soon as I got out of the car. There were rips and burns. Some of the embellishments had started to peel away. Someone must have just tossed it out the window of a car. Why someone would do that? Maybe it just wasn't pretty enough anymore. Or maybe it created weird shadows on the roof when the light was turned on. Maybe it smelled like mildew. It's the kind of thing you hear about all the time, but I just didn't think it would happen on my street. I don't know, I picked it up and took it home. What else could I do? I couldn't leave it there. In the cold, harsh grass. Cleaned it up. Then I covered it with brown paper. It's amazing what you can do with a bit of glue and some brown paper. I mixed two parts water to one part glue. I took some of the brown paper and ripped it into little pieces, crumpled it up, soaked it in the glue. I just kept putting them on. I wasn't sure if it would work, but I was like, this has got to work. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I remember when I finally had it all covered, putting it out in the sun to dry and just praying that it would work. I had some toast while I waited. We used a bit of, um, bit of oil-based stain I believe, and rub that all over, and then a bit of Mod Podge over top to seal it. And by that point, things were looking really hopeful, you know? So I took some cardboard, some two-part epoxy, made little dots on the cardboard, then painted it black, and finished off with some rub and buff. I wasn't planning to change the world that day, but I think for one lampshade I did.